Uh, Sandman is a comic I have read in the past. Um, one of the reasons I originally watched the <laughs> Lucifer series is because Lucifer first appeared in Sandman. Um, and that's where he was spun off into his own comic. Now, Lucifer, the Lucifer series was loosely based off of the character from the Sandman comic. Yeah. Um, so with, with the, the Sandman, they're going loosely based off the Sandman as well, but they're sort of going in a much darker direction where Lucifer went in a much lighter direction. Uh, so there was no way to really bring in the, the Lucifer from Lucifer and bring him into the Sandman. Uh, so they did reveal the Lucifer for Sandman. Uh, they did do a gender swap. Uh, which a lot of people pointed out. This is one of those times I don't see that as being that big of a deal, just because I also know when you have a similar show like that due to Lucifer, a gender swap is also to help separate and differentiate, yeah, those characters. So, Otherwise, if they use a male Lucifer and he really just curb stomp, like just yeah. dominates the role, it's going to crush the other show. So I actually see this as... Not just being, you know, yes, you need to differentiate somehow the Lucifer and Sandman and the Lucifer from Lucifer, being that those are somewhat linked because of comics. It's also a role um, they could have it switch. I mean, oh, yeah. like, this character doesn't really have a determined form if he doesn't want to. True. So I'm not really concerned when it's an entity um, that can swap around. Mm -hmm. And like I said, the reason they're not using uh, Ellis is because it's a lot darker Lucifer. I mean, this is a well. No, Sandman comic is not yeah. no holds barred. Like, um, this better be gritty. Yeah, this is supposed to be really gritty. It's something I'm keeping an eye out because I am interested in. I know you you're not as big into uh, the Lucifer and Sandman stuff. I'm familiar um, with Sandman, but I never really bit down deep. But I know it's dark as hell. Now I'm also very prepared that this is not going to be the comic. You know, I mean they they have been very open about this is a uh, loose and honestly the comic was really 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 dark so I, I i don't see that being uh put on tv anyway um though they do say this is and 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 i would say this would be required to do the comic is this is one of the most expensive series on netflix uh coming Man, I don't up know. does it have enough of a well i guess it's because they're riding off the lucifer fame because i the well, that comic has always I don't been think they're niche, riding off the niche. Lucifer fame. I think they're just riding off comics in general. Yeah, let's see um, what they do. I'm giving them a chance. Like, I don't see any reason to trip. Netflix is one of the few. Like, after The Witcher, I'm not going to kick myself in the butt by talking shit before it comes out because The Witcher was surprisingly good. And I'm not even that big a fan of The Witcher games. And I was like... Man, I it made me a Henry Cavill fan. I even liked Henry Cavill. I'm like, now I'm a Henry Cavill fan, and I like The Witcher show. So I'm going to go. Mm -hmm. Netflix can surprise you. Netflix can surprise you. So let, let's see what they do. I'm giving yeah. them a fair. Uh, so I'm going to keep an eye on this and uh, definitely want to see where that goes. <laughs>